as I'm in here in Bluebeam Review, let's talk about a couple instances here first. So I've created some custom markups here, and I want to add them to a tool set. So I can keep reusing them over and over again. So how do I do this? So over here in the panel area, I have the tool chest panel already selected. If you do not have it, it looks like a toolbox. You can right click on the panel, you can go to show, and you can access it by going down to where the tool chest is and selecting it. Or you can hit the Alt key plus X, which is the hot key for it, and it'll prompt it open as well. As you can tell here, there are some tool sets that live in my tool chests. And the ones that are currently shown are my tools and recent tools. Now, recent tools always displays your most recent tools. If you close out a Bluebeam review, they will not display any new recent tools. So if you want to reuse your markups, you want to drag them up to my tools or create a custom tool set. Now let's go over how to create a custom tool set. So when I hit the drop down up here, I can see all of the tool sets that I already have preloaded into my profile. So down here, I'm going to go to manage tool sets. I'm going to add some. I'm going to add one that is called structural. It is a new one, not existing. You could add one from an existing file path if you had one. They're saved out as .btx files. I can also have some options down here, such as display. Is it going to show up in my panel of the tool chest? Am I going to show it in any other profiles that I have in Bluebeam Review? And what is the saving method? Is it going to be a relative path or a not relative path? I'm going to keep it relative, and I'm going to hit OK. Now it's going to go to your default area of where you're saving your tool sets. So I'm going to just save it here. And as you can see, there's a checkbox next to it that is checked, meaning it is displaying. I'm going to hit OK. You can also change which ones are displaying by hitting the drop down, and from here, you can just select it. And you can see the two that have checkboxes next to it are saying those are displayed. Now I want to add my newly created markup to my tool set. So I can either A, go over and select the markup, right click, go down to the area here, and say add to tool chest, and select the newly created one that I created. Or I can drag, I'm going to drag my other one, which is just a cloud, directly down into my new tool set. You have two different view modes of these markups. If I double click on it, there is the drawing mode, which is going to do exactly that, keep the exact same copy of what was already made, as you can tell, and drop it right onto it. Or you have the properties mode, which in the name properties means it's going to copy the same exact properties, but allowing me to make a different cloud. So I can double click and change that view as well. Or I can right click and select from down here, drawing mode versus properties mode. And I'll show you how properties mode works again, copying the same properties. Just going to draw a cloud, and it's copying the same properties of it. Thank you for joining me today on my tips and tricks on creating a custom tool set.